Yo, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. <laughs> Man, I'm just out. I'm up this morning, you know what I'm saying? But it's 1024. You know, normal routine, none of the early stuff no more, because you know, I don't know if it's worth it. <laughs> but uh, I'm headed out to the zone. Let's see if we can get to that, y'all. I'll let y'all know. First delivery of the day. Good old biscuits. <laughs> oh, man, this is wild, man. Like, and every time during the week I come here, they have a new person at the register. So it takes forever just to make a simple order. It takes forever to make a simple order. It's so annoying. But I guess they gotta learn too, but still, man. Like. <laughs> so, sending me right back home, but for $13, okay. Yo, check it out. What the deal? <laughs> man, it's crazy. It's 145. It's a beautiful 76 degrees here in, the, in Arizona. <laughs> So I'm flexing on y'all right now. <laughs> but uh man, it ain't been too eventful this afternoon so far, you know. It's just been delivery here, delivery there, delivery here. You know what I'm saying? But I got about uh either five or six deliveries. I'm delivering delivery number six, I'm I'm guessing. I don't wanna close my mouth right now, so <laughs> oh I would really check, but so I catch right with y'all later. Damn, homie. R.I.P. Chicago Dog House. Man. I used to get good deliveries from here, man. They were struggling for a while, though. I was pulling for them. I, I was hoping that they could hang in there. Nice old lady that run this place, man. Yo. So as y'all can see, I'm at home. I'm home. You know, I've been delivering in my area all day. And this it's 3.30. It normally slows down about 3 o'clock. So I was like, just go, you know, instead of driving back to the zone and then waiting, you know, because around 3 o'clock it's slow. I'll probably get a couple of deliveries, but probably like a couple of small ones. I don't think it'll be too many big ones, even though I still got my app on. <laughs> but I just came home and just chill out, hang out for a little bit. It's Friday. So I'm probably gonna be out a little bit later than you know I normally would like to stay out. So see what I can get it in. I'm gonna get my 20 deliveries and I'm gonna get my 200 today. So that's all that really matters at the end of the day. But shoot, why not enjoy the sunshine? Just sit out and relax and enjoy the sunshine outside the car without my feet kicking up. <laughs> without my feet kicking up. Yo, what the deal? <laughs> I was sitting here chilling still for a minute because I'm about to get ready to get up out of here. It's 4.01 right now. So, <laughs> what the deal, y'all? So, you know, I got this history with this place it's called uh, Pizza Romano. So, you know, a couple years back, they just... <sighs> Gosh, like they like sucked really bad like when it come, came to you know just like having the food ready I mean it was typical like A1 blacklist restaurant I know I'm glowing I'm glowing sun just shining on me y'all but um but then you know like they got new management or whatever and like they just a whole lot better like, and I haven't had a problem with them ever since. So, but today I get there and, you know, it's two minutes after the pickup, supposedly. And, you know, it's a line or whatever, the line goes down. The pizza's done, the salad's done, but the wings aren't. And she's like, oh, we're backed up on all the fried food. So, you know, I do my due diligence on the map, I mean, on the app, tell them, you know, that it's gonna take a little bit. I'll wait for the order. 
So then I'm like, okay. Cause I'm just thinking it shouldn't take that long. So then I'm like, okay. I go up and I ask her, I'm like, how long is this gonna take? And she was like, maybe 15 minutes. Lying. I'm like, fuck, I mean, forget this, <laughs> forget this. I'm up out of here, man, you know, end up, you know, reassigning the order, man. Like, I've never reassigned the order before, I don't think, unless I've had one reassigned on me when I was uh, trying to get something to eat and get a delivery. While I was waiting to get something to eat, I get the delivery, but then it just took that long that they end up reassigning it. Something like that, but, like, I've never, like... I, I'm not waiting. But this is just ridiculous. It's a Friday, you know. I'm shining, I'm glowing. You know, I gotta make me some money. But, you know, then after I declined it, you know, or reassigned it or whatever, I get a double order, double, double order, order, double order, double, double order. <laughs> so I'm on my way to that now. You know what I'm saying? It's 548. I did like uh, three deliveries since I left the house. So let's get it, baby. I'm out here. Man, man, man. So it's 6.25. I just got done picking up the second part of the double order. Now, these people are neighbors. They're on the same street. But I swear I picked up that five guys probably like 20 something minutes ago. I've been sitting up in Ahi Pokey forever. And they just, oh my goodness, man. This is just not turning out to be like <laughs> the double order that I wanted it to be, man. This took just as long as it probably could have been for me to just wait for that pizza. Or uh, maybe not. <laughs> I probably would have just been getting that too. But anyway, man. <laughs> this is the point when I regret going home and relaxing because it was good at that time but ever since man like it started out good it started out good but after that double order at 645 by the way so after that double order now I get a delivery to Cold Stone which ain't that bad. You know, you just gotta go order the ice cream and then go drop it off. But it's like clear across town and then I gotta drive back to where I was just at for like $8 or something like that. But I mean, which ain't too bad, but still, man, like I need to get, deli I'm not doing enough deliveries right now, man. Like that double order took forever, you know. And then plus, you know, I waited for that piece of Romano that I didn't deliver <sighs> this turned out to be not s such a good night I don't know like what I'm gonna do but I don't want to be out here until midnight just to make $200 yo so man <laughs> So the double order, it took me from Queen Creek to Gilbert. And the piece of Romano before that one was in Santan. So now I'm going from Gilbert, picking up to go to Chandler. So you see how quickly and how far, how quickly I can be like so far from home. So now I'm at the point where I already burned a lot of gas earlier today being, staying around the house. So, in order for me to be profitable, I have to stay around the house. See, now that I'm going out, normally I spend like probably, I'll, I'll uh, use probably a little bit over a half a tank of gas per day to make $200. But, now, I mean, and since like the last few days, I've been using basically a full tank of gas to barely make $200. You see the difference? So, I mean, this is getting, 
It's getting goofy out here, man. It's getting goofy out here. Family. <laughs> it's 728 right now. 727. Glare. All right. I'm outside of uh, Fat Willie's. And um, I come to pick up this order. It seems like every order is a problem <laughs> tonight other than the Cold Stone. But anyway, I come to pick up this order and uh, I dropped the Cold Stone off at 701, by the way. So that was like almost 30 minutes ago. And the lady, she, she uh, said that they didn't have two, two items on the, uh, on the order. So she just took them off the order and refunded them. I do not like when restaurants do this. At least try to contact the customer or something. So when I get to their house, <laughs> they're not mad at me because they don't have everything on their, that, they, that they wanted on their order. Believe me, this has happened to me before. You know, I go to the one house to drop off the pizza and they didn't have the wings or they had wings and no pizza. And the lady, she was like, I order wings and pizza. I don't want it. So I had to call customer care. But anyway, anyway, get back to the point. So, um, so she says that's, that, that they just uh, did one thing on the order. So basically that was supposed to be pizza, but she had a whole 10 thing, like, and I guess it was wings or something. So now they have to make the pizza and they said the pizza will be done in 25 minutes. You get me? You get me, you get me, you get me. So, in this dinner time, on a Friday, I've only did like four deliveries. Well, technically three. And now, I'm waiting here for 25 minutes because she couldn't read the pizza on her app. Oh man, it's just my life. <laughs> it's just the life of TYT. Welcome. <laughs> Yo, what's good, fam? So, something else that bothers me, you know, I'm gonna make a segment uh, called I Don't Like. How <laughs> y'all think about that? Okay. So, is going to areas where there's a lot of bars. So, I just picked up at a bar, basically. I'm walking, trying to pick up the delivery. And you know, the people that work there, they don't really care about delivery drivers because they trying to get their tips. You know what I'm saying? So, um, and you know, the, 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 the patrons are drinking, having a good time. So they're not, you know, people walking past and stuff, you know, you know how it is. And then when you're out in the street, People that they're just walking all across the street, don't care like that a car's coming or nothing, and they're just walking, not looking where the hell they're going. Like I just went down a dark street, and you know, just going normal speed limit. Like I didn't see nobody, and then out of nowhere, like all these people walking across the street, I hit my high beams, you know, because I couldn't, I didn't see nobody. Hit my eye beam, hit my high beams, and I see all these people just walking across the street, the middle of the street, not an intersection, or not in the middle of the street. So, I'd rather not, you know. And maybe it's because I don't drink, but then again, you know, you know, when you're not drinking and you're around a people, a lot of people that are, it's just awkward. It's weird. You know what I mean? It's just not as fun as all the people that are drinking it are having it. You know what I mean? But anyway, <laughs> what's up, fam? Hey, I ain't complaining no more. I ain't crying anymore. I'm just finna head back to Queen Creek and see if I can salvage my night, okay? Because basically, what's happening is every place that I go to, they want me to wait 20, 30 minutes. Now, these people, they just ordered some wings and a slice of pizza. So that means to tell you that they order ain't even started yet. They order haven't even got started yet. So 
for six dollars, man, I ended up, you know, unassigning that one. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. Second delivery that I've unassigned ever <laughs> in the same day. In the same day. Crazy. <laughs> Heck done happen now. What the heck done happen now? Always an accident. Always a accident. Oh. something over here there's somebody in the tow truck over here slow down people be courteous let people over <laughs> this is an eventful friday man i don't know if it's good for content or <laughs> i hope it's good for something because man this is ridiculous so after i uh undecide that last order I get another one to Rubio's. I'm in Gilbert now. And I get to Rubio's at like 8.48. It's 8.54 right now. So I'm, I get out the car and I'm walking towards the door. And then you see the manager locking the door. So I'm like a couple of steps away from the door. And, like, and then, you know, you see him walking, but he's at the uh, the counter. So I know he see me at the door. So I'm like waving and stuff, but you know, like I'm a nice guy. So I didn't start like banging on the door or nothing like that, but I know he sees me. And then he just walks off and goes to the back. A couple other employees did the same thing. So then another guy walks up, you know, I don't know which app he's using, but or apps he's using. <laughs> he, uh, you could tell he's like, you know, he does them all, but um, but he walks up and he's just like, I'm gonna call support or whatever. And then all of a sudden, before he called, like a couple minutes later or a couple seconds or a minute later, whatever, the dude come, runs, goes, gets his keys and comes open the door like, oh, you guys have a pickup? I'm like, this dude, I like he didn't see me standing there all that time. <laughs> it's so funny, man. So, so funny. What the deal, man? So I'm in Gilbert right now. I'm in the Ville, Santan Village. And um, I just got a $13 delivery from Doghouse. And guess what? It's sending me to Queen Creek. Okay, so that's the $13 one, right? Just remember, I've been chasing five and $7 deliveries for the last couple of hours. Okay. Uh, and then, as soon as I uh, complete the pickup for Doghouse, then I get another delivery for Cafe Rio for 940 in Queen Creek. <laughs> I'm trying not to leave. <laughs> Just my luck. That's <laughs> my better hurry up. I got another delivery wait. Yo. <laughs> so after the Cafe Rio one, you know, it sent me basically to Santan, but I'm in Santan now, and I'm sitting here with nothing to do. So that's the end of my night, man. I did uh, 20 deliveries. I'm right on 20. 174. It's, ten, it's 1048. Soon, soon as it starts to die off, then they want to send me back out here. Hey, just, hey, like, comment, subscribe, and I'm going to catch y'all on the next one, man.